A Summer Afternoon by Benjamin King Read for LibriVox.org by Esther T'was the close of a summer's day. The sound of the flail had died away. The sun was shedding a lingering gleam, and the tea-kettle sung with its load of steam. The old clock ticked that hung on the wall, and struck with the same old cuckoo call. Then oft I could hear the mournful bay of some watch-dog far away. Then altar once piped in a jay. I just sought there with my senses gone, and the shadows of twilight are creeping on, with the eerie hum of the small peewees over there in the cedar trees, and the tinkle of bells in the marshy loam at told me the cows were coming home, and the sighing breeze came o'er the croft, but ah, comes a melody far more soft than the troubled notes of a Lydian lute, or the echoing strains of a fairy's flute. It bids me awaken, and live and rejoice. Tis only the sound of Elviry's voice. Like an angel's whisper it comes to me, Wake up, you fool, and come to tea. And it ain't in the spring, er it ain't in the fall, But the close of a summer's day, that's all. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.